Hey there, welcome to The Green Room. I'm Natasha Gargiulo. This week at CinemaCon, Lionsgate revealed some news on their highly anticipated Borderlands movie. Now, the film is an adaptation based on the popular video game, and it stars an ensemble star-studded cast led by Kate Blanchett, Kevin Hart, and Jamie Lee Curtis. Now, Ariana Greenblatt and director Eli Roth were both in attendance to give fans a sneak peek of what to expect when the film is released later this summer. Legend has it there's this massive treasure hidden in some secret vault. And if you go hunting for it, you'd better take any help you can get. Tiny Tina was such a trip to play. I think I played a bunch of the video game and I watched all the clips. And I think I watched a lot of gamers talking about the movie and their opinion on Tina. Um, and also my brother's a big gamer, his friends are big gamers, so I asked what is necessary to bring to Tina. Um, and I kind of went off of that. You know, doing a movie rendition, you have to kind of bring your own flair to the character and bring some humanity, so I definitely incorporated some of that. But I kept her as true as I possibly could, and yeah. Ooh, mine's bigger. What I did was I talked to Randy Pitchford, the game creator, and I said, I want to do an adaptation. I want to make sure that we're in the world of Borderlands, but first and foremost, we're making a great movie. And if people play the game, they're going to love it. But if you've never played the game, you're going to love the movie. I think definitely kind of just like the physical transformation I went for with the hair and the costume and even the voice, different like fluctuations I would do. I love looking as different as possible for characters, so that was definitely fun. Um, and also just working with Eli and collaborating him with him with the character was like so fun every day. <laughs> I was most excited to obviously work with Kate Blanchett. I mean, she's incredible, and we had the mo we had the best time working together on House of the Clock and its Walls. Um, so as soon as I had Kate, I knew I had a chance to get Jack Black to play Claptrap. Once you have Kate Blanchett, it's easy because because Kate comes on and everybody wants to be in scenes with Kate. So then. Jamie Lee Curtis signed up, Kevin Hart, and then Florian Montanel, and then, you know, just the discovery of this century, which was Ariana Greenblatt, um, pre-Barbie. So she, she came and she just rocked it in the audition, and I knew she was going to be perfect. And, uh, you know, as soon as we saw them all together, we all just started laughing, and that's always a great sign. We genuinely became like a family. I know everyone says that, but this one, it was so true. Um, and every day was so fun. I mean, Kate and Jamie, just working with them and learning from them was such an honor. I wanted something that was visually spectacular and fun from start to finish. I wanted the tone of a movie. I didn't want to make the you know, heavy, oppressive, serious sci-fi. I wanted you just grab your bucket of popcorn and have a great time at the movies.